closer here to home. We have to turn to weather on this Saturday, a rainy day. So you got to have that umbrella, the boots as well. Just prepare to go outside and have those drops falling. Yeah, is it? Is it bad of me to like kind of want the rain today? So Not I can at all. Stay inside? I love those days. Have Turn like on the a fireplace. Yeah. yeah, pop some popcorn. Get all cozy. Yeah, and I'm I'm with it today. And yes. then tomorrow it's also going to be a first alert weather day because of snow. Okay. Well, extra reason to stay inside. Exactly. <laughs> so right now it's actually pretty mild. 51 degrees southeasterly winds, five to ten miles an hour. And we started off at 54 degrees. We'll stay steady in those low 50s. But right now we still have a lot of widespread rain on the way. Heavy downpours moving in for places into Washington County, also into Green Fayette County through this morning, Garrett County, Maryland, and then rain pretty light into Butler County and Beaver County and Armstrong County right now. But this will still pick up through this afternoon. A wind advisory goes until 2 o'clock in the morning on Monday with gusts expected up to 50 miles an hour through tonight and tomorrow. Laurel Highlands and the ridges also under that winter weather advisory until 2 a.m. on Monday. Two to five inches of snow and the heavier amounts of snow, those higher amounts will be into those higher elevations and also into the Laurel Highlands, Butler County, Armstrong County, even places north of I 80 picking up maybe one to even two inches. So right now a big temperature difference for places like Somerset at 37, then to 50 degrees in Washington. We have that southwesterly flow that's pumping in all that warm air and moisture and widespread rain will be picking up through this afternoon and then tomorrow morning where it's going to be cold enough to see those rain showers switch over to snow showers then we'll have some bands of the snow through the afternoon. Wind speeds 10 to 15 miles an hour. Wind gusts picking up already 20 to 30 miles an hour for the ridges and wind gust here in Pittsburgh, even though not under a winter weather advisory, still looking at some gusts picking up around 20 to 25 miles an hour. So through today, we'll have a few of those heavier downpours, especially all the way through the afternoon, catching a little break around five o'clock with just some light rain showers and then on the backside of that system, northwesterly winds kick in, dropping our low temperatures to around freezing overnight. We'll have some bands dropping a decent amount of snow for places. Again, those ridges, areas north of I-80, and this will wrap up very early Monday morning before we clear out and have a little more sunshine for the start of the week. We already picked up about a quarter of an inch of rainfall, an additional half of an inch to even three quarters of an inch as possible through today. And then in terms of snowfall, most areas into places like Oakland, Gary County, Maryland, Somerset County, two to even four, upwards of five inches. And then areas north of I-80 could even pick up two to three inches, but places like Butler, even into Indiana, Latrobe, Washington, Pittsburgh, half of an inch to an inch. So we had above average temperatures right now. We're back to trending near normal March 16th through the 22nd. Best chance for rain. It's today. And then after that, snow showers tomorrow, and then we'll dry out for the start of the week. 32 degrees tonight, rain to snow, very blustery tomorrow. That 40 degrees will feel more in the 20s. So we have back to back first alert weather days this weekend. Don't forget, we lose an hour of sleep tonight, but we gain more daylight so in the evening. So Monday, 46 degrees, lows in the upper 20s, 32 on Tuesday. Then we nearly double those lows, getting back to 60 degrees of sunshine Tuesday, 63 Wednesday, near 70 on Thursday with late showers and a few scattered showers on Friday. Back to the low 70s.